good practice, uh, as I was hoping that we, we would be. Guys are uh, excited about uh, being on the team and excited about uh, being a team again as soon as Sunday and uh, getting up there and giving a great effort in Eugene. So I'm really looking forward to uh, putting together a great plan uh, as we uh, get closer to game day. How much of a, a factor in recruiting is, is the fill factor with them? The whole, you know, uniform? Oh, the Nike factor? The bells and whistles, all they have. <laughs> how, how, how big a deal is that? Well, I think they make it a huge deal. I think, I think uh, anybody that's ever been up there, and we, we talk to kids who take those visits, that's, that's a lot of what they talk about. I mean, uh, it's, a, uh, it's a showcase for uh, the swoosh, there's no question. Can a program up there maintain that? Can, I mean, can they? Well, they, uh, the, the ability for Nike to stay as competitive as it is it stayed is, is proof enough that they can do that, you know. So, uh, but, but, th but that's not to take away from the great coaching that's getting done there. And uh, it's not to take away from, you know, there's some good football, I mean, really good football players, and there's some really good football coaches that have built a very, very prominent program. So much of sports is about a routine and schedule. With a bye week and a Thursday, does it any concern that throws things? You try to create as much of a normal C as you can. Uh, it's difficult when you've got students, you know, because days are not really, you know, we in, in the in the coaching world you talk about well that's a Friday and that's a Thursday, you know, in anticipation of a Saturday game. So Sunday will be a Tuesday practice, as an example, but. Uh, the classes, you know, do find a way to get in the way, <laughs> as they should, and and so you got to you've got to work your way through that. How much is uh, Kevin's knee uh, altering the competition at quarterback right now? We rested him today. You know, uh, we felt like that was the right thing to do to uh, try to get him back to uh, as close to full speed as he can be, and and we'll see. You know, two days off right now are, are, is a terrific thing. So hopefully uh, we'll be ready to roll again on Sunday, and he'll feel good. Have you seen anything close to his speed since the Texas game? Or his uh, yeah, he, he actually was pre feeling pretty good uh, when we came back uh, for the uh, Cal week, right after the Washington State. You know, he took a lot of that week off. But, uh, but uh, you know, there's, it's just wear and tear, you know. So we, rest is always good. Yeah, yeah. Well, as I listen to our medical people, that's just part of the deal, you know. So there's going to be rest involved. Part of the deal of that kind of a knee condition. Yeah. Is it a meniscus or something? You're asking the wrong guy. <laughs> I wished I could tell you. Yeah. Yeah. As far as what he's able to do in practice, is there certain plays you're not putting him in for? No, no, no. He 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 gets the whole contingent. Okay, everybody else good?